Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. Alright. Yo, 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 This is Games and Graphics. We are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod video for you. And we are going to be doing the MLO Bayview Lodge Motel and Store Interiors. Okay. So this one right here is also created by Bamboozle. Shout out to the creators. I'm gonna show you a couple of screenshots over here. This will actually give the hotel uh, rooms over by uh, Pleto Bay um, or Bayview Lodge. Yeah, and Pleto Bay. This will actually give the interior to the rooms, to the hotel rooms, okay? This is over there at the Bayview Lounge. Uh, right there in this screenshot is right where that big uh, lumberjack is at, all right? So when you get down to this page right here, what you want to do is read the description and come over here and select the green arrow to download, okay? And as of requirements, you are only going to need Open 4. If you don't have it, there will be a link in the description to a video showing you how to install Open 4 if you don't have it already, all right? So make sure you have Open 4 installed and after you have this downloaded, on my left hand side, I have the Bayview Lodge downloaded just by itself right here. And on my right hand side, I have my Grand Theft Auto 5 directory opened up and ready to go. And I also have my Open 4 installed also. So what we need to do is um, have a mods folder in our Grand Theft Auto 5 directory. If you don't have one, go ahead and create a new folder and name it mods, all in low caps. Once you have that created, you want to come down here where it says update. And you want to copy the entire update folder okay once you're done copying the update folder go back to the mods folder that you created and open it up and you want to paste your update folder right here inside your mods folder after you're done pasting your update folder here go ahead and open it up and then open up 64 then dlc packs and leave this open right here now let's go over to our bayview lodge folder that we downloaded open it up Inside that folder is going to be two options, one for 5M and another for single player. We are only going to be installing single player today, so open up your single player folder. Inside the single player folder is going to have one folder in a readme, okay? Let's go ahead and take that one folder that is inside right here, and we are going to drag and drop that folder over here to our DLC packs. And as you can see, it will be added right there in your DLC packs. Now what we want to do is open up Open 4. Alright, my Open 4 is open up right here on my right hand side. Before we go any further, always make sure that you have your edit mode turned on. It's this button right here near the top right corner. Select it and turn edit mode on. After that is on, you want to come to the side column in Open 4 and select the update folder. Okay, once you select the update folder, come over here and select update.rpf. Once you open that, there will be a red banner that pops up. It's going to say copy to mods folder. Go ahead and select copy to mods folder. After this copy, go ahead and select common. Then select data. Then scroll down till you find dlclist.xml. Right click with the mouse and select edit. Scroll down and you want to find the last item line. And we want to copy that last item line. Place the cursor behind that line, press enter on the keyboard, and paste that same line that we copied. So now we have two of the same line. Then you want to go back to the folder that we dragged and dropped inside of our DLC packs, and you want to just copy the name of that folder. All right. And we are just going to paste the name of the folder over this name in the item line. Okay. So now we have a new item line for, um, for the lodge, the INT underscore lodge. After that has been added, go ahead and select save. Then go and select file, close all archives. Now that we have that installed, let's go ahead and minimize any of the windows that we have open and run the game. All right, when you spawn inside of the game, what you wanna do is uh, be down in this area where it's Polito Forest. And this is where we are going to be at. As you can see down here is at the Bayview Lodge where that big lumberjack guy is at right here. All right, let's go ahead and open up the map. And this is where the location is at. All right, it's in this area right here. All right. Oh my God. 
Now let's go ahead and back up because this is going to be over here that we had installed was the interiors for the room. Okay. Let's go ahead and just park our Tesla truck right there. All right, I'm gonna show y'all this one uh, before the uh, hotel rooms. It also comes with the store. Put away my weapon. <laughs> so you got the store in here. It's all nicely detailed and everything too. We got uh, the dirty magazines, the cigarettes, <laughs> the uh, scratchers, you know what I mean? You got everything behind the counter that uh, a store would have. You got the snacks. Look like you could buy some uh, some hiking gear or something like that. Some bags, lights, uh, toys for the kids or something. Some beer. You know what I mean? Some more snacks and all that. You know what I mean? Nice little convenience store. And in the back, you got uh, the employees and stuff working back here. They got a little cool little break room and everything. What's going on, y'all? How are you, baby? I don't I'm very care. well, thank you. Or good, as you Americans would say. What a place this is! One big loony bin! My god, I've never seen the like! Okay, well, I'm glad you enjoyed here in America, okay? Um, alright, carry on, carry on. <laughs> alright. Alright, let's go check out these rooms. Alright. <clears throat> We come inside this room right here, and we have the full interior as you can see. We got the TV right there, the TV's on. We got uh, the bed and everything right there. Um, what's that, some cigarettes and stuff, wine, all that nice little stuff right there. All right, we got our bathroom and stuff. You know, it looks just like a real hotel, everything a hotel would have. Oh, look like my car just spawned on me. Let's go check out another room. So all these rooms are going to end up looking all the same. You know what I mean? Which is, you know, just like a, a regular hotel. You know what I mean? They pretty much all look the same. Got the same curtains, you know, same uh, bed beddings and all that. You know what I mean? Plus it's, you know, like a little cheap hotel. You know what I mean? So yeah, this definitely is cool right here. We got a little closet right here. A little open closet. <laughs> Yeah, man, shout out to the author, man. They did good on this one, too. You know, check out uh, one more. Sometimes you can't get out of the hotel because the table might be right there. Just jump over it. But like I said, see, all the hotels, they're going to look the same. You know what I mean? It's pretty cool, though. You know what I mean? Take a load off my feet right now, you know. <laughs> there we go. Let me go park it right here on this dirty-ass mattress. <laughs> But we're going to wrap it up right here, folks, if this helped y'all out to install it. Or if you just enjoyed the video, feel free to smash that like button for your boy. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share the video with y'all friends that are in the modding GTA 5, y'all. This is Games and Graphics. Me and Big Ball and S. Frank, we're going to chill in this little hotel for a minute. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.